So you've probably heard that you can make tens of thousands of dollars per driving for dollars deal. Well, that is 100% true. This year, my average deal size is a little bit over $42,000. My goal is to do 50 deals this year with a 50% profit margin. So I'll let you guys do the math. I believe 100% if I can do this, you guys can do this. I really don't feel like I'm the smartest person ever, but I have a system and process that I understand and that I use to get these kinds of results. And even better than all this is I'm gonna share with you exactly where to start and how to get started doing exactly what I'm doing. Everyone, if you're not subscribed, make sure you do so and hit that bell icon. Everyone, my name is Zach Booth. I used to be a window cleaner not too long ago. Driving for dollars has completely changed my life and added a ton of value to myself and to many people around you, around me. Um, and just so very grateful for it. And this channel is dedicated to help you guys get some of the same results that I've been able to enjoy. I wanna know from you guys, I'm gonna challenge you to do something in this video. I'm gonna challenge you to go out and implement what I'm gonna teach you. I'm gonna challenge you to spend about one hour of your time and add 100 properties to your first driving for dollars list in this video. If you are willing to do that, if you're up to a one hour challenge, comment in the section below, I will do it. I made so many mistakes in the beginning when I was trying to do driving for dollars. It took me hours and hours and hours to build a list of only 100 properties that I wanted to reach out to. Now it only takes me an hour to add 100 houses. It took me months and months to get my first deal because I didn't know what I was doing, right? And on top of that, once I did start doing a few deals, my average deal size was only 12,000, which may sound really good to you, but my average deal size now is over $42,000. I make $30,000 more per deal than I did before because of all the mistakes and the things that I was doing wrong. So I want to share with you the right way so you can avoid a lot of these expensive mistakes and more importantly all the opportunity costs. I want you to be able to make the tens of thousands of dollars that is possible in this industry if you do this correctly. So please support me by hitting that like button and helping me out. Okay let's break down the steps of driving for dollars. The first thing you need to do is you need to have an app. The reason for this app if you do not have it you're gonna to have to drive around the areas and write down the address put it in an Excel spreadsheet then go to the county courthouse website or the county recorder's office website right and look up who owns the house the mailing address the property address then you're gonna have to go find the phone number for that person by you know either looking it up online or paying a skip tracing service like batch skip tracing right it's gonna take forever to build a list of any size your goal is to build that list as fast as possible so you can start marketing to those homeowners that have uh, properties with physical signs of neglect so the app we use is called deal machine I do not own the app I'm gonna give you a discount code not because I'm trying to make money off of you but so you guys can get a free trial use discount code pin pin so this app right it's like a Google Maps image when you hit start drive on your first drive it'll route track where you've been so you're gonna stay organized you know where you've been when you see a house that has physical signs of neglect you're gonna touch the house on the phone and it's gonna upload all of the information of the homeowner into an Excel Excel spreadsheet ready to go for you you got to make sure that you hit the tap to add so you may want to watch a few videos and play with the app but it's gonna allow you to ha add at least a hundred properties every single hour of driving which is crazy if you've never you know done this or even thought to do this before so the next step to driving for dollars um, is reaching out to those property owners and see if they want to sell so you went out you added properties with physical signs and neglect now you have with deal machine you will have their phone number uh, if you pay for the phone number, you'll have the mailing address, the property address, and potentially an email. Right now you need to reach out and see if they want to sell. So what I do is I text, I cold call, and I postcard. I suggest choosing one, right? Choose one outreach strategy before you implement more. If you're gonna text, a great texting service is Batch Leads. That's who I'm using to text. You can use my discount DFD to get a big old discount. You don't have to, but you can if you want to do that. If you're gonna cold call, you can buy the phone number and call one by one right there within the deal within deal machine, and it won't cost you any more than, than just buying the phone number it's not very efficient you can use a, a, a dialing platform that calls multiple people at once um, I've used mojo I've used a, a call tools I've used a couple different ones call tools and mojo are great companies both of them right now we're currently using call tools and then if you want to use postcards 
you know, very simple, right there within the Deal Machine app, you can create your campaigns and send postcards to see if someone wants to sell. The piece of advice that I give you, right, is a very simple process. You add properties, you see who wants to sell. Your success and your efficiency is gonna have a lot of different variables. How well you negotiate, how, how long you've been doing this, do you have a cash buyers list? Are you wholesaling? Are you flipping? Are you just trying to find discounted properties to hold as rentals, right? So you really need to identify what you're trying to accomplish. Why are you doing driving for dollars? What are you gonna do with the deals once you have them? And once you understand that, but first we're gonna pause because we have jets flying over. So as you implement, there's lots of other little variables. Like if you're gonna do postcard, what should the postcard say on it? What should be the template? How many you send and how often to a property that you add. You know, if you're gonna do cold calling, what should be your cold calling script? Are you gonna have a triple line dialer or are you gonna have a 10 number dialer? Are you going to add any property with physical signs and neglect and have your criteria be where you add 60 properties an hour? Or are you gonna be a little bit more uh, particular on the criteria and only add 10 properties per hour of driving? Also, where you drive is going to affect what you're doing, right? There's all these variables, and I ch talk about all of these variables on this YouTube channel and on my podcast, right? Because driving for dollars can be extremely profitable, and it can be even more profitable if you make some adjustments, right? So my suggestion is this. Start with a system, right? Come up with a system. Choose your criteria. Choose your area. Start driving driving and start doing the work. Keep track of what you're doing and the results that you're getting. It's known as your KPIs, Key Performance Indicators. Track what's, what you're doing and what your results are. So how many postcards were sent and how many people responded. Of those responses, how many of those people did want to sell, right? How many were actual leads? And of those people that wanted to sell, how many did you go on an appointment with? And of those appointments, how many contracts? And of those contracts, how much money and how much expenses, right? So then you can really look at what's working and what's not working. And as you make adjustments, you can see improvement or you can see if the system got worse, right? You guys can go through and test this and figure all this out and try and figure it all out. Um, and that's what I had to do. And I, and I started teaching other people what I was doing and you know looked at their numbers and looked at what was working and not working for them. And together, my students, we've perfected what I do, right? It's why I make so much money. It's why my profit margins are so big, right? So if you guys have any interest in learning about my coaching and allowing me to help you implement my exact system, you know, without having to test or figure out any of the little little tiny changes that can make a major difference in the effectiveness of your driving for dollars, I'd love to help you, right? It's really easy. You can go to the link in the show notes and book a call with us um, and learn about the coaching, learn how to have, how you'll have my cell phone and have complete access to me. Also, I have an awesome piece of free content right here. Uh, this is where I took $1,000 and turned it into $93,000 in 40 days doing driving for dollars. And you can see it in action. You can get a lot of action steps and criteria and what to look for and how to use the app and how to cold call and the script. You can get all you really need to get started if you'd like to start that way. But anyways, I'd love love for you guys to jump on a call with us if you'd like to. If not, and both, you know, check out the content. Anyways, thanks so much, guys, and we'll see you in the next one.